Hi, I'm Beth with 50 Plus Beauty, and I am so close up with you today because the problem is with my eyebrows. And as you can see, I have a lot of gray in my eyebrows on both sides. Not so bad on this side, but on this side for sure. So I've decided to try just for men, and I just opened everything just a moment ago, but to try just for men. And I actually tried this about three years ago, and unfortunately, I had had my brows lightened. I do that myself at home with some ash brown hair color, which you shouldn't do, by the way. But I've done that for years. Just, you know, use a little bit up there. Be very careful. And so it would lighten up my brows to kind of a dark blonde color. But it got to where I had too much gray. It wouldn't really cover the grays. And so the last time I tried this three years ago, I did it and I left it on for five minutes thinking, oh, what, what harm can this do? And I had Groucho Marx black brows and I had to figure out how to get that color off. It was no fun. It was an awful experience. So anyway, this time I'm going to use this just for three minutes. And a lot of you in the comments section said this really worked for you. So I'm going to give it a try. And basically it comes with this set of directions like this, very easy. And then it comes with two little tubes of Just For Men Color Base and Just For Men Color Developer. And in the directions, it says to squeeze an equal amount of each in the little tray that it comes with. And here's a look at the little tray it has. And I'm just going to put like a pea size amount of the, maybe a little bit more, a big pea, we'll make it a big pea, of the Color Developer. There's a pea size amount of the Color Developer. Now we'll do a pea size amount of the Color Base which looks about like that. Not too bad at all. And then I am going to, oh, I've got, I've got two little brushes here. And one of them I'm going to use to put some Vaseline around my eyes to keep the color off my skin. And then I guess, which one will I use on my, is that one better? Maybe I'll use this one to apply the Vaseline and this one to apply the color. And it says to leave it on for five minutes. Okay, I'm going to use this little mirror I have over here to just put that Vaseline around my eyes. And this is my Vaseline I have, petroleum jelly. Yeah, that was something that wasn't fun when I had my Groucho Marx eyebrows, is that I did not do this step, and so they truly were like Groucho Marx. They were huge. There we go. I'm going to church this morning, <laughs> and that's in about an hour, so I sure hope that this works out okay. Otherwise, I'll be quite embarrassed. My son plays the bass sometimes at church, and so I always try to go there when he, when he plays. Okay, now here is the little brush I'm going to use to mix up the Just For Men. There you go. Mix that up really, really well. Oh, and this is, what color is this? This is the lightest color they had, which is blonde, blonde. So we will see. I think last time the viewers had said to use like a medium brown or a dark brown, and I did, and my, it was brown. Okay, here we go. Here goes nothing, as they say. Put that on there. Oh no, where's my cell phone? Ah, oh there it is, it's right in front of me. That got it up there a little bit. Now I'm gonna put it on the other side. And then I think I'll go back and put it on the other side again, just to make sure. Get those grays all covered. How bad can this be? I mean, this is just a tiny little bit of area on your face. But I'm a little afraid <laughs> because before when I did it, it was bad. It was really, really, really bad. Put a little more over here just to make sure to coat everything well. Seems like for some reason my gray brows are right in the middle of my eyebrows more than any other place. Huh. Okay. I'm afraid, let's go ahead and set this timer for three minutes. Okay, I just set the timer for three minutes. 
And I'm just going to sit here for the three minutes and let you see the colors change. I'll kind of fast forward the tape, but we will see if we can have good brows and cover that gray. I'm still scared. <laughs> It really doesn't look too scary. I mean, it doesn't look like black or anything. So I think that's, that's good. Okay, we're getting down, down to the wire here. You know, and it took me a little while to get this on. So this has probably been almost four minutes, I would say. Doesn't look horribly scary at this point. Okay, there we go. We did our three minutes. I'm going to take my little Walmart wash rag. These are the rags that I use to uh, clean off my face to do all my skin care. Oh my. <sighs> ah, I've got darker brows, but I still have the gray in there. I still have the gray. As you can see right there, I still have gray. I have darker brows, but I still have the gray in there. Let me go ahead and just put some color on the gray and we'll see if we can't just deal with that color like that so I can leave it longer. There's a little bit of gray over here. We'll just stick that on there. They said you can leave this on for up to 10 minutes. So maybe another five minutes just on these really bad grays. I mean, that's really what I want to uh, take care of. Okay, now it is just on the grays and I'm going to go ahead and set this for five minutes. There we go, and I'll go off camera for this. Okay, we're getting down to the wire here, 19 seconds left. I don't know if this is gonna work, girls, because it seems like I see some gray up in there, but. We will see. Maybe I should give it more time, I don't know. If it doesn't work, I'm gonna ask for your tips in the comment section because I really want this to work. It seems like it'd be cheap and an easy way to get those grays under control. Okay, I guess, I guess it quit. Okay, let's go ahead and take this off again. Scruffle that color off. Oh, wow. Oh, gosh. Okay. I think that looks a lot, lot better. I think I can see maybe a little bit of gray in there, but it is definitely not bad. It is definitely not as bad as it was. Okay, it is about 2.45 in the afternoon. I did go to church. Alan and I then went over to his mom's new place at Rushwood Senior Independent Living. And she's lived there two days and she really likes it, although she keeps bringing more stuff over from her old house into her new smaller apartment. And so it's getting a little crowded in there. But anyway, it's hard to let go of our stuff. Now, I noticed that in that video, when I was editing the video just a few minutes ago, that the gray was still showing. So I went ahead and did it for another five minutes and I don't know, let me know in the comment section. I feel like I'm, <laughs> I'm erring on the side of Groucho Marx again, but apparently this dye does fade over time just through the course of taking showers and that kind of thing. I don't know, it feels really, really dark, but I have to say, look, there are like pretty much no grays there. Maybe, maybe a little bit right there, but not too bad at all. So let's go in and put a little bit of this L'Oreal Infallible Brows Brow Mascara on top because maybe that will blend it in. Look at this now and tell me if you like the really dark look. I'm not really liking it, especially in this mirror over here. It looks like black. It looks like I have black brows. But let's go ahead and just put a little bit of this on here. Not a whole lot. I think that one looks a lot better. I'm, not, I'm still not sure if it looks acceptable because actually I just made this part of the video a few minutes ago and when I put it in the editing bay, it still looked terrible. So I went and I kind of washed my brows out again. 
So anyway, well, <laughs> I think they look a lot better than they did because they don't have the gray. Let me know in the comment section if you think the Just For Men is good on its own, if you liked those black Groucho brows I just had just a few seconds ago, or if you feel like you like the Just For Men effect with the addition of the infallible brows from L'Oreal, or if you don't like any of it and you think I should just let my brows and my hair go gray, let me know that too, because right now, having gone through this, I can see why women do that. And if you have any comments about using Just For Men, any tips or tricks you would like to share, I hope you'll share that information in the comments section below the video, because that way we can help each other. Take care, and I'll see you in my next video.